Hello guys, here is Olga Ivanova from idatomarketonline.com and today I want to tell you very simple and basic things. Actually, recently I changed hosting of my website and it took some of my efforts and times. And today I want to tell you about the foundation. So about the domain, the hosting, what is the differences, what is the WordPress there. Okay, the domain is just a fancy name of your website, like a I did to market online, for example, or like uh, the famous and big google.com, facebook.com, and etc. And when you choose your domain name, uh, it should not be long, big, like uh, seven words or more, uh, and it should not have double letters. And when you tell this name, for example, me on the phone, I can write it one time on the paper, correct. And the result it should be clear, understandable, and easy to remember. And uh, the another tip: when you think of your website name, don't do this very loudly, like a cash machine or like a how to make cash within the next 24 hours. Because uh, some newbie, for example, when see a website, your website in browser, and come there. Uh, he or she may think that it is something about big company and see personal blog and it could be a little bit confused. Choose your domain name uh, more personally, like your name uh, and uh, more classier. But sometimes it could be di difficult. For example, Olga Ivanova, very common name and it's your name and I choose many different variations when I think of my domain name. So finally I decided to name my site uh, after my slogan, what I'm thinking, what I'm doing here. So I did to market online. Here is my website name. Okay, the next is hosting. Actually, this is your home or in the internet. Your uh, where is all your content of your website, all your images, files, uh, hosts, and etc. are storage, and um, uh, this is a place where you can manage and under your control. Anytime you can change something there, uh, but there are several companies which may. Uh, offer you hosting. Uh, in this case, the name of this company will be in right side of your domain name, and it actually maybe it doesn't look very professional. Maybe better to use own hosting. And the next is WordPress. Actually, this is the content management system, and uh, the good things is uh, that you don't need when you use WordPress, you don't need uh, to know the code, the HTML language or SQL. You just write your post or page is there, you use images there. When you log in, in your WordPress site, in your back office, you can do any analytics. And uh, when you, for example, you buy your domain name, you make your hosting, and the first thing you do is you install your WordPress. It's like a basic, like a foundation of your website on which will construct it. You will construct uh, post, page, images, the design, surely. So that's all for today. Any, if you have any questions, got in contact with me, ask me, got me a friend request. I will, I will share everything I know. Have a good day. See you soon, Olga.